Hi everyone, my name is Mike Vansicle, and welcome to my course, Moving Beyond JSON and XML with Protocol Buffers. I'm an engineer at SitePen. Inter-application messaging has long been dominated by XML and JSON-based protocols, especially when the applications needed to work in a language-neutral way. Protocol buffers offer a third option to consider with the promise of decreasing message size and increasing speed, sometimes by a factor of 10 or more. This course is going to get you going with protocol buffers and show you how to integrate them into your applications. Whether you're looking for an alternative to JSON for a web application or as a more efficient transport mechanism for use in your microservice-based backend. Some of the major topics that we'll cover include how to use protocol buffers in server-to-server -server or server-to-client applications, creating messages with protocol buffers, how to organize protocol buffer definition files to work together, how to safely version messages, and how to get started with protocol buffers in the many languages that are supported. By the end of this course, you'll know how to work with protocol buffers and integrate them into your next application. Before beginning the course, you should be familiar with inter-service messaging patterns such as AJAX for client-server applications. I hope you'll join me on this journey to learn protocol buffers with the Moving Beyond JSON and XML with Protocol Buffers course at Pluralsight.